Hey everyone, welcome to From the Depths. I'm Minty, and this is episode 23 of the Tank Tussle Season 2 Tournament. This episode, we've got the Darkest Crusader by Bodyless continuing its run. It will be coming up against the HT3 White Death by Drew. Go ahead and get the camera in position here, and we'll get this battle underway. Let's see how it goes. Both things missing their initial shots. They have, wow, almost... Almost, uh, oh, never mind. I was going to say, I thought it looked like they had almost in sync firing rates, but it was only that first shot. After that, it seems to be different. Now they're both landing pretty consistent shots on each other now. Closing in. White Death is turning away to make some more distance. Exposing that rear armor, though. Hopefully that rear armor is strong. Darkest Crusader goes up. Huge explosion there. Not sure exactly how uh, that explosion happened. It may have clipped the top of the turret. I, did, I wasn't uh, looking directly at it when the uh, explosion went off. Darkest Crusader is repairing away. But I think the gun is disabled. And now it's immobilized. I'm not going to DQ it for uh, its weapon being disabled until it runs out of materials. Because theoretically it could repair itself. I sincerely doubt it has enough materials to actually do anything. But you never know. It could end up repairing itself enough to uh, at least get its gun sent, you know, firing if I'm not exactly at full effectiveness. But no, it is now out of materials. Three materials is close enough. Yep, there it goes. Has no materials left. Its gun is still not firing. Hasn't fired for like over a minute. So that is going to be a TKO, a kill for the White Death. Go ahead and get back into position. Get this battle back underway. Both tanks once again missing their initial shots. Second shot's also missing. And third! <laughs> Ooh! Up goes the Darkest Crusader again in basically the exact same way. I wonder if it... I wonder if maybe uh, the frag shell was detonating under the edge of the turret. And then the fragments are going up and in and hitting uh, something explosive. But that's basically the exact same way it, the... Darkest Crusader died last time. Looks like the White Death found a uh, flaw in the Darkest Crusader's armor there. That or it's just punching it through the turret neck. That may, may be it. Sure, doesn't look like there's any penetrations from the front. So I think the frag shell may have been hitting the side or the side of the turret or something, and then detonating, and then the fragments core in and explode the magazines. But again, the Darkest Crusader is not more than 25% behind. And it still has materials, so its gun could theoretically get repaired, even though practically uh, there's probably no way it's going to repair anything important before it runs out. I mean, it's basically the same thing as, happened, as what happened in round one, so I'm not going to expect a different result from uh, two, you know, almost identical things.
That would be the definition of insanity. <laughs> All right, all right, that's enough. Two materials. You're not going to fix anything with two or one or two materials. So, White Death getting a uh, TKO double kill on the uh, the Darkest Crusader there, claiming a victory for itself. I'm really curious. As, I didn't expect it to happen again, you know, in the exact same way so quickly, so I was still zoomed out. Hadn't moved in yet. And up with the Darkest Crusader. But anyway, uh, check the description for those approval votes. And uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you on the battlefield.